everyone. Good morning, Mimi. So is joining the group. <laughs> Walking, come here, Mimi. So <laughs> go, go, Mimi. So oh, that means she's getting better. That's Mimi. So that's the one I rescued from the dog pond, and she has TBT and I undergo for chemotherapy. Come here, Mimi. So. Maybe so. Oh my god. Maybe so in the group. Come here. Come here. Mm. <laughs> Maybe so it's da. So did you notice anything? I was just wondering if you guys notice about the changes of your dog after spay and neuter. So like for example, the Mamie saw and the other dog right there, there then span also the brown dog right there. So do I notice any changes of their characters after I spay them? Uh, <laughs> probably yeah, I think so. The behavior after the spay. Because before, these two, after the spay neuter, they really just wanted to be like lay down wanted to sleep more just sleeping compared before and their appetite was good about eating so i'm happy and it, it is important to have your dog spay spay the neuter to prevent all diseases in the future probably I'm not really sure I'm not an expert but that's that's what I've heard if you have your dog then spayed and neuter it prevents them from having multiple diseases so look at Mimi so she's recovering and I'm glad because after a few days she started to go for walking along with my other dogs after her camel. Ah! Come here, come here, come here, come here. That puppy. That's the puppy that I got from the dog pound. So the changes of the attitude of my pets and the character after the spring neuter. I think the behavior was that all the time they wanted to just sleep. I think almost all the time sleeping. Their appetite. It's good. Yeah, and they're not picky. And also, just they just stay at home. Most of the time, just stay at home. They don't really go wandering around. Just like before, I spayed them. We just used to go wandering around, but after I spay and neuter them. We just started to stay at home most of the time. So that's the um, big, big changes of the behavior of the dog after I spay them. Spay and neuter is really important, especially when you use up stray dogs and cats. So they will stop multiply. So they stop having puppies they don't multiply well that's the importance of spay <laughs> Mimi so it's it look at Mimi so Mimi so Mimi so it's it so their attitude character after I I have done spay and neuter them is huh? They used to stay at home most of the time, just sleeping. That's the difference. They really like to sleep most of the time. So they don't really go wandering around after I spay them. <laughs> Mimi so, Mimi so. Let's go back. Let's go back, Alilab, Alilab. Let's go back. Let's go back. Mimi so, it's it. Mimi so, what's it? Mimi so, go. 
So if you have your dog spay and neuter, they will stop multiply having having the puppies in the future. That's the importance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Love. Hey Miso, come here. Hey Miso, it's it. Ale. I'm going to continue about our topic today. And our topic is Did you notice any behavioral changes from your pets after being spayed or neutered? So, in my own opinion, I think so because. When, when I have my dog spayed and then after a week or two weeks after being spayed and she just, most of my pets just wants to stay at home. Uh, they don't really want it to go somewhere. It's like most of the time they want to go sleep, lay down, just more time of sleeping. Mm. Okay. I could tell. Give me Hey, I don't want to have look at the love. Mm. I have one kitten right here. Because some people was just asking me, um, did you notice any behavioral changes of your pet after being spayed or neuter? And then, yeah, one thing I could tell is like, their behavior um it's not the same before before spade because before we used to go wandering around and just just wandering around most of the time but this time after spade my pets just stay at home most of the time they really wanted to go outside if i have another dog with me go for walking because that's their Routine. That's a part of the routine. But this time, <laughs> most of my pets just sleeping all day. Just sleep, sleep all day. So that's the number one, I think. And then some of my dogs are irritable. So they irritate when when other dogs are approaching to them. I do not know it's because of the stitches or in the healing process. Or I, I don't know exactly. I have a rescued cat or dog. I really want them to, to have the spay and neuter. Because I don't want them to multiply and create problems in the community. So that's why I really want them to go for spay and neuter yeah that's the main thing <laughs> playful pup then the kid